No churn mocha affogato. First thing you do need though is super icy, icy, icy cold cream, whipping cream. And we're gonna add one and a half tablespoons of instant espresso granules. I put this in brownies and chocolate cake, it really enhances the flavor. So always have some on hand. I don't think I've ever really drank espresso from that, but I do use it in my baking. We're gonna get this whipped up. I have it on as high as it can go, and now it's just being patient and waiting to get all the air in there so it turns into this light, fluffy whipped cream. Whip away! You can really see it to start to thicken up. It's about there. So, now we're gonna fold it in to one 14 ounce can of sweetened condensed milk. And you just wanna like fold this in three times because what we wanna do, or we don't wanna do, is take all the air out of that cream that we just whipped. Affogato is one of my favorite and easiest desserts. Affogato means drowned in Italian because you're drowning the ice cream in espresso. This is it, this is our ice cream, and then we're gonna add some chocolate chips. So as you know, mocha is chocolate espresso. So that's what we're making. We're making a mocha ice cream, starting with the espresso base. Okay, this looks good. I don't wanna over mix it. Now I'm gonna grab a loaf pan. And we're just gonna start layering in some nice semi-sweet chocolate chips. Did you see how easy that was, by the way? We just made ice cream, you guys. Now the freezer does all the work. So just mix it in. Another layer. I do love ice cream, but now I get to make it and I can make any flavor I want. I get one last layer in there. Mix it around one last time. So you could make this the night before if you feel like it, if you're so inclined, but it only needs about four to six hours in the freezer until it sets up. And it's gonna be this lovely, luscious, creamy ice cream. I'm using the mini chocolate chips. I like the little tiny minis a little bit better, but you can use bigger chocolate chips. Okay, then we just cover it up. This cool little thing is called beeswax wrap, but if you don't have that, you can use plastic wrap or parchment paper. And we're putting a cover on it because we don't want a film to happen on top of the cream. So this goes into the freezer for four to six hours, and then we can make an affogato with it. Let's see what she looks like. Oh, looks so creamy. Pour a little coffee over that, and a little coffee liqueur. It's gonna be a great affogato. Yum, wow. that looks amazing. That looks amazing. What Here did we go. you do? I made no churn yeah. ice cream. Oh, I love it's that. It's good, right? Yes. And coffee. So this is the ice cream. I made Yum. mocha ice cream. And I have some coffee liqueur. Ooh. This is our affogato. Oh, but we're gonna start affogato. with a little bit of coffee liqueur. Nice. And then we go to our coffee. Oh, I love it. Oh, it's both. It's off. That's so cool. Yep. And what flavor is your no ice, cream ice cream? Is coffee? Yes. <laughs> yes. With chocolate chips. Yeah. So this oh, is all about coffee on coffee on coffee. We wouldn't function without coffee. That's Thank true. you. Oh, the coffee like starts the ice cream melting. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, wow. This I is love, really good. I love lots of flavors, lots of textures. Check out the creaminess of the ice cream. This is no churn? Mm -hmm. no churn. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. It's so custardy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right? Wow, that's fantastic. 